Again, just waiting for the opponents to like actually show up. Hope everybody, if you are actually in Ohio, I hope you're staying warm. And if you're not in Ohio or if you're just somewhere else, I still hope you're warm because one of the worst feelings in the world is being cold. Oh, we got War Machine coming up next. Going up against Peg GL809. So, we're most likely going to have Dalsum versus Karim. I believe he, I believe uh, GL809 still uses Karim, but I don't know. He might pull a surprise and be like, hey, I'm using this guy now or this girl. All the sign-ins, all the button checks, all the character selects. <laughs> all right, we finally get to the buttons. Looks like Matchstick actually is uh, doing things in his game. Hey, he won a ma he won a round. Awesome. Hopefully, he actually like wins the game because that would be nice. Have him a little encouragement when he's like, you know, back on stream commentating with me. Oh, oh, so we're finally going back to Duff City. I didn't know he remembered how to use this character. For a long time, it's like, oh, I'm going to do Dawson. I'm going to do Dawson. I'm going to do Dawson. Dawson. More Dawson. This is going to be a match to remember. Smack. All right, good corner carry. Oh, whoa. What were you hitting to get that crush counter? Oh, that's that stun just went all the way down. Could have kept that momentum going. Very nice. Is able to keep it going. Oh, watch those overhead, sir. You know, for a Karen player, well, takes around, but still, for a Karen player, I'm not seeing. I'm seeing a sufficient lack of stand medium kicks. That's like her best button. <laughs> okay, not right there. Hmm, <laughs> trying to get, trying to get, trying to close that distance because both of these characters want to be in your face. Because neither of my projectiles are really long hitting moves or long range hitting moves. Whoa! What was that? 
he's fortunate that was the only thing that happened as a result of that because that could have been way worse. Uh, I, yes, yes, your jumps work. Both of your jumps work. Oh, smack you out of that, that Rasenha. All right, well, Buff got around the piece. All right, opens up with a dash punch. Doesn't get anything out of it. Hmm, interesting trade. No, we can't throw out them sweeps like that. All right, gets thrown. Hmm, I see what he tried to do there. He's just a little out of range. All right, good throw. Keeps him in the corner. Oh, whiffs his throw, but gets thrown in return. Now he's tracking the corner. Good, good. Do the virus to keep him in. Hmm, jumps out. Immediate two hits into super. The final attack. <laughs> now we're set to neutral in the center. You know, I appreciate the goal of just walking up and just raw V trigger activation in your face. Like, what are you going to do? You're going to stand there and hold this. Oh, nice anti air jab. Not able to finish it out yet, though. Oh, there you go. Overhead. GL809. Up one game against War Machine. So, is War Machine going to stick with Balrog? Is he going to go to Dalsum? I think he has a third character, but then again, I could be wrong because he switches it up so often. He's thinking, nope, right back into it. See if he's able to make the proper adjustments. I mean, if we're going to be honest, the proper adjustments that Balrog would need to make against Karen is punch her until she stops moving. Easier said than done, though, right? <laughs> All right, nice B reversal. Get some to stab some space, but he's right back in with the EX dash punch. All right, see, I like that he's throwing out the medium kick, but you got to be selective of when you throw. It's a good button, but you can't just, you know, and they both missed the grab there. Can't just throw it out because you will get whiff punish. I like this. Both want to get in, but are kind of timid on how to approach. Mr. jumps in and gets thrown to the corner. Ooh, it's a good thing he didn't hit a button because that probably would have killed her. All right, get back in that corner. Oh, snuffs out the jab with the jump and punt, jump and kick. Good spacing. V reversal. All right, get off of me. No, <laughs> I love that. This the micro walk jabs, jabs, jabs. Nice spacing on that. Mm, all right, nice jab to the face. War Machine gets around. Hopefully, he can actually get himself on the scoreboard. Wombstone, what's happening, friend? I didn't know who that was. I didn't know who that was. <laughs> All right, very good on Karen's part. Did, establishing the spacing. Oh, yeah. All right, so. What up, guys? Match stick back again. How'd you do? Uh, I took the first game off of Ryan Vile. So, you know, not bad for, pad, for playing bad today. All but, right. Uh, yeah, the, the, the other two were not uh, anything to speak of. Well, there's always next time. It's true. Maybe next time I can actually bother to bring my stick. Well. But I had to leave right from work today, so I said, fuck it. These things happen. It's true. Anyway, we have a very large man in a very old costume beating up a small blonde girl. Oh, he's been, like, she's actually been beating him up. Oh, yeah, look at that. Mm. Like, it's kind of surprising that War Machine went with Balrog. I thought he was going to go straight to Dalsum. Like, I Ooh. thought he was no longer a resident oh. of Duff City. But he War Machine finally gets himself on the board. One yep. game each. It's a good Welcome thing, too, to because Duff nobody City. wants to... See, it's a good thing, too, because nobody wants to see a blowout. No. But, uh, you know, uh, props to GL809 for taking a game off a of War Machine. I know, right? You, you would not figure that those two were in the same or on the same level, but... Uh, I wonder if it's they're in the same level or if one's messing up. But regardless, he managed to take a game <laughs> off. I'm not trying to downplay that. It, it could be, you know, like a Vegeta 18 thing, you know. The first time they fought, she barely won. I mean, like, she got she got the advantage in a, in a critical moment. She broke his arm by kicking him. 
Yeah, but I mean, like, she wasn't that much stronger than him. Now, if anything, I would say it would have been more like, uh, well, I don't know if you've watched Super or not. <laughs> yes, yes, I have. Okay. If anything, Vegeta versus Jiren. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Oh. He got a couple good hits in, and he said, all right. <laughs> like, oh, no. Well, that's okay. Vegeta's going to be waking up, w waking up some secret bullshit power next episode. <laughs> Hopefully, well, we'll see. That's what the, that's what the preview said, anyway. I don't. I never trust the previews. Because the previews are always lying. Oh, man. I played Rob. He just Oh, I know. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that's that, that's, that's what Rob does. Yeah. Yeah. Best of luck to you, Lucas. Yep. Oh wow, they went right back into the same character. They sure did. Oh. Well, I would have to say that Kareen is uh, GL eight or nine's best character. Oh, it is. And if uh, War Machine's on a winning streak, then he's probably not going to switch off. Oh, they're both doing really well with their spacing now. Oh, Before, yeah. they were just kind of throwing it and yeah. just seeing, hey, are you going to run into this? Now Please run into this. Now there's respect. Uh, more fear. <laughs> <laughs> eh, one, one will substitute for the other in a pinch. Yeah, like right there. <laughs> It's like, oh, you want to throw a sweep in here? Just eat this, eat this dash punch in the face. Only reason he didn't do it there is because he did not have the charge. Mm. Man, Tibetan where, monks need a weed whacker. I was like, where was the jumping heavy punch that comes straight down? Oh. Speaking of, love the standing heavy punches there. Get so yeah, off me. Balrog's getting a really weird uh, throw, I believe, in the next uh, in, the, in the next update. Basically, the the Ultra Two from Street Fighter Four yeah. is becoming a command grab. It's just it's just not that good. It wasn't good. It wasn't good then. Yeah, well, <laughs> but now it won't do like three or four hundred damage. Now nice. now it'll just be like bad and ba yeah, bad and impractical. Well, we don't. Oh, oh no. no. You can hear the angry pop-off from GL809. That was not a pop-off. That is a fit. <laughs> that man is throwing a fit. Because he knows that was not what he wanted to do. Oh! Ow! Ah. I, I, can I can see the steam running right, out of the seams. Right off the BAT. <laughs> like, he he's just out of it, man. I mean, look at that. He's yeah. like, ow, look at that. Sock yeah. him out. He, he gets up from the control. He he's walks gone. away from the stick. He's gone. Man, he's... Mm, Oof. That is unfortunate. Well. With the uh, obligatory FMLs as he walks away from the stick that he clearly effed up on that round. And he was just mentally defeated after that. But War Machine takes it. 2-1 over GL809. So, he said, he said, you guys can find me in the Alps. Yeah, you might need a soul-searching hike after that. <laughs> we say, I say these things, but it's all love and, and, and faith in here. It's true. Oh, look at that! Look at that hug from Rob TV. Aww. He says, "Do not be sad, young GL809." So we're gonna see who is up next. Yep. Well, let's let's check the background real quick. All right, so Rob TV and Ocelot Youth are uh, winding their way towards Loser's quarterfinals. I think they're up. You may be right. But we've also got Hitman and War Machine in the other quarterfinal. Uh, loser's side. Right now, Lucas and Ryan Vile are fighting each other. Yep. As uh, well as... A-Chef and, and I don't even play this game. game. Smiley face are, are playing right now. Oh, is that what that is? Yeah. Oh, it kind of got cut off. Ran out of room. <laughs> All right. Well, in any case, let us go back to current events. <laughs> Rob TV. Versus XDSC Ocelot Youth. Oh, I've just been doing the. I've been doing it without the XDSC. Uh, Oh. <laughs> I didn't know it was there. What the fuck? That, that's fine. H he'll live. All right. And we'll be ready to go there. Very, very good. Oh, don't worry. They're, they're not set. They're not set. Okay, yet. I was wondering, like, why are they so off-center? <laughs> 
you know, Ocelot you hates to be on camera, so he'll... Well, I guess with the Hitler haircut, it doesn't make sense. It makes sense. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm not... You heard me. No, I didn't. That's why I asked what the You heard me. I just heard a haircut. Exactly. You know what I said. <laughs> He was saying you don't like being on camera. And I was saying, like, well, I guess with the, the Hitler-esque haircut, it makes sense. <laughs> That's fine. I'm just, the, I'm just the ethereal voice that talks trash about everybody. Meanwhile, Rob TV just fades into the blackness of the background. <laughs> Oh, don't even act like I'm the first one to make that joke. I have video oh proof of you and Chad sitting right here. We can do that. Yes! You can. You are the pastiest one here. <laughs> it hurts when you say that. <laughs> I'm also the best one, the looking one in a do-rag. You're not the best one ever wearing a do-rag. Man, man, man. Man, man, man. Yeah, I, I've, I've seen him in a do-rag. He, he's got you beat, dude. Who's, who's this? I'd like to take a picture and a video. Oh. He's not even willing. He's not even willing. He just did. That sounds non-consensual. <laughs> hey man, we don't we don't use those words around here. No means later. <laughs> so we got those are backwards. They are backwards. Yeah, uh, matchstick melee. Twitch start. Yep. Matchstick melee. Correct. Birdie versus Akuma. Rob says he knows uh, his matchup, so let's see if he can put that to good Rob, use. Rob says, I saw what Taquito did, and I can I can do better than that fucker. Hopefully. He's doing a good job with his spacing, though. He's staying out of the range of Birdie's yeah. long-ass normal. He's, he's winning at the moment. And how? Ocelot just needs to channel that Mena RD. Uh, oh, no. That's too I just, short. I just messaged Mena and told him that uh, Eric and I are going to play each other. That's right, you guys got to meet him down at Kit, didn't you? <laughs> oh, I'm so jealous. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> That'd be really awesome. That'd be cool. Thank you, Sarah. Yeah. Well, I know he's like a whole bunch of flying moves today, but he's uh -huh. got his light on the way. Oh, that sucks. Maybe he'll want to work it. Nice. Yeah, maybe. Rob TV takes the first round. <laughs> yes. Or at least one way a really good neutral end. You can do it. I believe it. I'm playing great tonight. Oh, nice headbutt. Ow! Catch it, uh, catch it those close moments into the ER. You can't be getting Got hit it. by those moves. You don't have that much health, sir. And he hurts. It's pretty hard. Yeah. yeah. Dash up, uppercut. Get slammed down. What's the mix up? Oh, yeah, no, no. Everyone's, everyone's oh. Like flipping their shit because Chun's legs, uh, air legs went back to plus four on block. And, uh, Mm. Oh, no, Man, you guys are just whipping everything. Like, no, she's still got the they killed her in uh -oh. so many other ways. Rob TV <laughs> takes that first game. One zero. Damn. But yeah, I'm, now Ocelot don't play any other characters, uh, heard, so it's just a question of what adjustment is he going to be able to make to be able to get back into this game? Because Rob TV knows his matchup according to what he said right before the fight started, and it's clearly showing. But I wonder if it's more of knowing the matchup or more of he knows how Ocelot Youth plays. Probably both. Taking a moment to get his composure. Character select. If anything, he's going to change costume because he ain't switching characters. He don't play other people. There isn't any other characters in this guy's mind. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay, now he's commentator's not. curse. No, I know what I said, and it's gonna it's, it's gonna show. <laughs> it's, he, he's magically gonna have Birdie on screen when when the, when the white disappears. <laughs> All right, going into the fight. All right, so so Ocelot you does actually have a pocket Vega. This is not just for show. Are you sure of that? Uh, I'm I, at the show part, not oh, not the well, pocket part. Uh, Mmm. Mmm. That that pause though. Oof. So we're just gonna it's act the, like that didn't happen. It's the rest pause that refreshes. Oh, sure it is. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Every time you get hit with that over, that overhead, you just say thanks, Capcom. Yeah. Welcome to uh, welcome to Glass Cannon, starring Rob TV. 
Ow. Oh! Did you see him shimmy uh, into that DP uh, too? Uh, yep. He's just like, no, no, I'm, I'm three inches too far away. Let me just, uh, 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 uh. Yep. Shin kick. You get kicked to your shins. Oh my god, Rob's got the most... <laughs> the most douchey face on I've ever seen. When doesn't he? Oh, oh no! <laughs> this man is just smiling away. It's like, oh, what a lovely day for a stroll. Hey, also I got the combo. He did it. All right. Victory achieved. I mean, hey, oh, victory. Oh. Looks like Rob forgot about Vega's ability to jump off walls. Nope. Oh. Unhand me. Oh, no! Mine's didn't better get there than enough. yours! <laughs> didn't get there in time. That's all right. At least Ocelot did not blow the critical arc. Oh, here it comes! Speaking of. Yeah! Yeah! yeah. All right! He gets around! <laughs> awesome! Now all he needs is a full critical gauge going into the next round. Yeah, that he doesn't have. <laughs> Oh, nice open sweep. I'll trade on wake up. Poke. Oh, yep. That poke was a little bit suspect. Was it? That need, that need to the claw seemed a little far away to connect off of anything. Really? This is Capcom we're talking about. I know, I'm not surprised. I know. Oh no. This is. Oh, this is going. Uh, this is not, not a slobber so knocker. This is just a regular old knocker. Oh, where was the uppercut? For the anti -air. Oh, he's doing a spoon! Hmm. Oh, no! Well. <laughs> As I said. <laughs> he doesn't have. He doesn't have any. There are other the characters in his mind. If it ain't birdie, it ain't happening. <laughs> No. But Rob TV takes it over uh, Ocelot Youth 2 0. That's true. Send that birdie boy to losers. Indeed. So, we should be seeing who is up next. Uh, I believe we have the option of two fingers up. Oh, wait, I got it. Where, where'd your mouse go? Oh, wait, it's over there. It went over there. So yeah, we're probably gonna see Hitman and War Machine. Ooh, that's a good one. Yeah. That's always a good one. Yeah, they'll actually play with their characters. Oh wait, is Light Red coming in? Light Red, are you are you back on stream, Light Red? Oh shit! Oh boy. Let's see who she's fighting. Yeah, who's she fighting? Come on. There. Yep. Who's, who's fighting? I, I don't know. We gotta, we gotta see. Uh, oh, GL809. Oh, that's right. She did say she had to fight Eric. Oh, boy. Yeah. Let's, uh, let's hope he don't drop any critical combos like he did the last time he fight. Losers. Losers 3. <laughs> You all right? I've been fighting a dry hacking cough ever since the, the big chill. Oh, that, that sounds gross. <laughs> I'm, I'm not technically infectious. I'm just, you know, I just got crap in my chest because all the heaters are blowing dust everywhere. That sounds awful. It's not great. I actually ended up taking a um, a piece of mesh screen from a computer build that I had, and I just did, it, it didn't go with the owner, and they never wanted to come back for it. Uh -huh. I ended up placing that over the vent that sits right above my um, right above my couch. Okay. And uh, it's it's helped a little bit, I gotta say. Oh. Uh -huh. I swear, I swear. Eric, I just want to make sure my down button works. Eric, GL809, as the, the, the image of like someone who directs movies, but not very good ones. Okay. Uh, he's, he's got the leather jacket on indoors, he's got the baseball cap on, he's got the thick corner and glasses. It, it's like he made it's like he made the Dominican Republic the room. Well damn. Mm. 
Oh wait, can you uh, pop uh, chat for me? There we go. Six people after th after two weeks of inactivity. Thank God. Thank thank goodness for all of you folks. Well, we appreciate you Y'all are your, the. You, you appreciate you spending our your evening with yeah. us. Yeah. You are the best. Best. Oh, I'm getting game over. Here. And happy Halloween, I guess. What's a Halloween? Ooh. Technically, all weens are hollow. It's like, oh, Guile, huh? All right. Yep, uh, that would be uh, GL's number two character. Well, if the number one don't get it, I can... Oh! Oh! I thought Lightbright had a really good combo going in there. Well, it did until but, it got uh, G GL was just watching a little too close, that's all. I mean, in terms of... In terms of uh, of obfuscation and, and change of direction, Lightbright had it. It was just, uh, GL was just watching close enough to catch it all. Oh! Alright, so no V-trigger for Lightbright. Oh! And the claw is down. Oh! Got over the air throw. Very nice. Oh no, she tried to keep going after that crystal flash, was not able to do it. Very nice! <laughs> you cannot help but have a good time when you play Light Bright JPEG. Oh! In behind the flash kick! Grab him! Nice, keeping it safe, keeping it stylish. Get off me. Relinquish me, villain. Oh, all right. Oh. Yep. I've been there far too often. You're in the perfect jump range for Guile, and everything in your brain is screaming, jump, jump, jump. You never listen to that voice. Oh, got him behind. Nice follow-up. Oh! Nice oh, damn. Lightbright taking a game! Lightbright taking that game! <laughs> oh, right! Look at that! Look at that! Since I'm not... Since you don't gotta sell me nothing, you ain't gotta give me nothing, I will take that game! I will take that game! That's... That sounds... That sounds kinda rapey. <laughs> so you know I can take whatever I want, right? Uh... I need an adult. I am an adult. Well, she, she is playing Vega. <laughs> All right, back to character select screen. He's going to pick his please. actual character. <laughs> oh, go right. back to Halloween Town. We'll probably go back to Halloween Town. Yep. Yo, so all we need now really is for Disney to buy Capcom. And, hey, not only will Capcom have money again, but uh, we could probably get a Jack Skellington costume for Vega. I want the, I want Capcom. I want Nintendo to buy Capcom. That would probably be a if, smarter if, move for the If for they the were going to be bought by anybody, I want I would want them to get bought by Nintendo. Yeah. Does Microsoft still own Rare? Yes. What are they doing with that? Killer Instinct. Okay, so nothing then. It's, no, it's still getting stuff done for it. I mean, it exists. I'm not going to argue on that one. It's a good game, too, and that's the sad part. It's yeah. The platform it's on. It's true. It, it kind of got sentenced to the to the worst-selling console of the last two cycles. I mean, it eventually came to PC, but at that point, it's like... Yeah, at that point, it's like... It's like, what? Ugh. Like, everyone who can appreciate it is just kind of like, Yeah, I, I didn't buy it for the Xbox. I'm not going to buy it now. Mm. Damn. That's all right. Classic costume Kareen is no match for Halloween costume Vega, I guess. I don't know. No, I guess Jay Lato 9 got tired of losing. Uh, there we go. There's the momentum shift. Oh. Problem with the uh, Kareen Car being a bit more mobile. Get off me. Yep. Than Vega, other than uh, Guile, I mean, is that GL's, uh, yeah, GL's more evasive 
and Light Bright's really gonna have to set up all those aerial attacks a lot more. Damn! Facts! Facts! Oh my god! Oh my god! Alright, I appreciate that. Taking a yep. second. Calm down. Get your get your composure back. Oh, yeah. She might even switch costumes. Or send a text. Yeah. Or both. <laughs> it always it always amazes me when I see somebody like sending a text to, on the pro stage, like right before playing a game. It's like, um, uh, you, th there's things happening. Who is? When people are using their phone, they're usually looking at everything. Man, they're they're Dance? texting. That works. I, I see motherfuckers up here like this. Some no, some do, some do. Be like, baby, get out of my DMs. I'm about to play. I'm about to get bopped. What do I do? <laughs> Don't get bopped. That's what you do. Don't get bopped. Fuck bop. you. You're not helping. Hesitation. What up? Hello. Welcome. Welcome. I keep forgetting the chat. So How, how's Mansfield doing? Is it cold? I'll bet it's cold. It's Ohio. Of course it's cold. Yeah, but they ain't got no buildings. Like I said, it's Ohio. Of course it's cold. <laughs> All right, so here we go. This uh, this will be the deciding one. Wouldn't it be some mess if like if Lightbright just turned on a switch? It was like, oh, Ultra Instinct, bastard. Yeah, that'd be great. <laughs> it just became like, like it just became a super. Oh, hesitation fan. moved to Vegas. I didn't know that shit. It's probably warm there. At least I hope so. Let's go. I don't know who that is, but Vegas is nice this time around. Yeah. Oh. Drive. No one told me about this, Hez. Oh. All right. This is this is more of a more of a straight fight. Oh, oh. That's not safe though. Uh, okay. I, I guess he wanted to prove a point, like, hey, I, I don't need the meter. I guess. <laughs> yep. This is, this, is, this is a show of force. Hey, where'd the coat come from? <laughs> Seriously, where'd the coat come from? <laughs> Alternate costume. What costume? In her, she puts shit on. She's rich, she can buy anything. Even, you know, even what clothes. costume is that supposed to be, though? Well, I think she stole Alex's bomber jacket. <laughs> <laughs> like, I've legit never seen this before. <laughs> oh, no. Come on, Light Bright. Get back in this. Oh, no. Ah. EX dash into throw. Oh. Yeah. oh. <laughs> well, that super worked. Who the fuck does that? <laughs> <laughs> Great question. Who the F does that? That's a shame. I could have sworn that uh, he was standing and, and blocking at the time. Oh, what costume uh, is that? I, it's just her. Yeah, it's just. Oh, is it? I don't remember her wearing that. No, it didn't. That's when I'm like, what the fuck did that coat come from? <laughs> Yo, she was just cold, you know. She needed, she needed a thing. She needed a thing to wear. Oh, by the way, if you hit that big uh, circle thingy, that just resets all the scores. Oh, I know. Okay. I'm just waiting to see who pops up. <laughs> what do you mean main Karen now? He never not made her. <laughs> Hell, that's the only reason he won. <laughs> hey, you know, you know what? Props to Light Bright. She had a convincing first game. Oh, yeah. She was actually doing cool things. It was pretty neat to watch. Oh, yeah. So... So now we got Ryan Vile, it looks like. Who is he going to be playing? Looks like Taco Supreme. Oh, buddy. This ought to be interesting. Does this say Punk is dad? Yo, uh, throw, throw, it, throw it to... to <laughs> throw it to us. Oh, boy. What happened? I just want everyone to see this. Punk is dad. <laughs> What? Old school. It just says punk is. It just says punk is dad. No, I see that, but what? Why? It's just hilarious. I don't know. Oh, okay. I mean, I suppose so. 
So, speaking of dad, I'm, I'm almost in full super dad mode tonight. I got my got my baseball cap. If I had my Superman shirt, why does my hat le never look straight? There you go. There we go. Okay, that'll work. All right, throw, throw it back to the things they want to see. Oh, they don't want to see your extremely ghost face and my extremely silhouette face? Hey, look, they're only able to see you because the light's bouncing off of me. Like I said, ghost face <laughs> and silhouette. I know what I said. <laughs> so, Taco's going to go with Ryu. Does that mean I can be in the Wu-Tang Clan, too? No. One needs to get one needs to either get ousted or die before there's an opening. I see. It's the same well, thing with the tribe called Quest. You the, don't just walk in. Okay. Well, I must kill the other ghost face then. I will be a ghost face killer. Kill a. Uh, kill a. Uh. Yeah, I'm gonna spell it with the E R. Nah. Yep. God damn it! See, you I caught myself hitting the save, and it didn't save. <laughs> <laughs> Like, I literally said click, and I thought, okay, it's fine, and then it just didn't click. <laughs> uh, Ryu should All probably right. stop leaving the ground. Yeah. Because <laughs> it hadn't been working out so hot for him. Boom. Oh, I... For, for, it's a jump throw. For a second, I thought I heard Kikokens coming from the TV next to us. I was like, no, who's doing that? Oh, uh, pop chat back up. There's a lot of people getting thrown a lot. You're right, Hez. Fuck Laura. I don't know if you mean that literally or just saying you don't like her. Or probably both. Bam! You should probably specify. Yeah. I heard she oh, can't no. I heard she can't spam that medium kick anymore. Oh! Gut check. Really? He had enough time for the medium standing punch after that. Yep. I just assumed that EX elbow was safe. Not the medium one. I'm like everything else in this game, medium version isn't like the end-all be-all with her. <laughs> that looked, that just looked funny. Yeah. Like she threw that punch out and then the very next frame you see, ah! <laughs> <laughs> Everyone looks so freaking skinny next to, next to Birdie. Yeah. He's like 500 pounds. It's true. And yet still has nothing on Abigail. That's all muscle. Literally like, nothing. Like. Freakishly so. Yep. Uh oh. Like, like if, it, like if Birdie and Abigail lived together, Birdie would just be that asshole who's constantly like, but look, Abby, I'll just stand in one leg of your pants. Why would he be wearing his clothes? I don't know. It just seems like the kind of thing Birdie would do. He's British. He doesn't give a fuck. Uh, uh, okay. He just does the weird shit that comes to his brain. Well. Well. Again, Taco Supreme yeah. with that stand jab. Taco Supreme is Taco Surprisingly good with that review. <coughs> right back into it. See, Ryan's problem is he spent too many nights playing Killer Queen. Okay, I I hear that and I know and I have to remind myself it's a video game. Because I hear that and I'm thinking of the stand from JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. Oh yeah. Oh Ooh, nice kicks. Interesting shimmy there. Oh, he's trying to get that stunned up, but he sure was. I'm surprised I'm not seeing either of Laura's anti airs whenever he jumps in. Yeah, uh, I it's uh, and yeah, and I can't say that Ryan Vile doesn't know where they are or how to do them because uh, he was primed for them during our match. Yeah. He never landed one because like, I never jumped when he thought I was going to. Yeah, but. it was like right there. And he jumped in. I'm expecting yeah. e elbow or EX one. Or just oh, wow. Thrown right out of the EX. And there's another one. Taco Supreme really laying it down in this, uh, this match. Good for him. Yeah. <laughs> well, considering that he basically gave up uh, M. Bison, who was, uh, it, uh, I would say, his early main in this game, probably due to, uh, I would say, uh, XDSC uh, Hitman. Like, uh, good for him for finally finding somebody that he likes and uh, can pull off good uh, good victories with. Yeah, and it'll actually be good when he, you know, Arcade Edition comes yeah, out. He'll true. be good again. Yeah. 
Nice uh, tech. Um, yeah, what? nice technique there. Wow, drop that. That's shocking. I think Ryan might have had a few. Oh. No. Cool. Nice. He knew it was going to dissipate, so he jumped. It's true. Yeah, Ryan's really, uh... Ryan's trying to put in the work on the edge of the screen here. He's got the life lead. He just needs to find his way in and deliver that final blow. And keep things alive. If he dashes out of that, uh... The thunderclap, he goes through projectiles. Nice hits. Oh, just a little too far away, but he nails it with the elbow. It, it Whatever wor works. It, if it works, then go for it. If not, then it was a bad idea. <laughs> it's, yeah. But if not, it was a genius move. Exactly. Welcome, welcome to Guessing Fighter 5. <laughs> now, that was season one. Uh, it, it's, still, it's still Guessing no, Fighter 5. No, it was really season one. <laughs> like, they had the more frames of delay and everything. Oh, yeah, it's true. Oh, wow, just raw dogging it. Okay. Well, it has armor, so yeah, I mean, what is he going to do to stop it? Oh, that it was a good read. It was just early. Funny. That would have been funny if that connected. Yeah. It would have been like, hey, while you're up here. <laughs> while I'm up here. Yep. <laughs> All right, so we're back to, back to fireball game. Oh, Ryan got tagged with a jump in, but looks like he's got... Oh, he had an extended combo going. I don't know if he knew it was going to connect or not. Oh, nice crush face. counter. One game each? Yep, Ryan Vile on the board. All right. Oh, man. I'm so wet and slippery. Hope I don't <laughs> pop out of my top. <laughs> <laughs> I was saying, like, oh man, I hope I don't, I hope one doesn't just plop out real quick by accident. A chuckle. <laughs> and yeah, she would be the person to say the word chuckle instead of actually chuckle. That just reminds me of that Futurama episode where, where time is skipping forward and, and, and Amy, Amy's just like, what could be causing it? Is it my outfit? Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Elbow, actually. Elbow Takuru. Very nice. Ryan Vile, I think uh, I think he's learning his patience. Also, I think he's remembering, hey, I can walk behind this thing. It's true. I, I have capabilities. Oh, that's a pretty good chunk of damage, though. He's got to keep Get that from me. happening again. Yep. Ah. Relinquish me, Falcon. Oh. Ooh, he's huh. gl glad that thing disappeared when it did. Because that would have been a trade, and he could have just grabbed him, and it would have been done. Now we haven't seen uh, we haven't seen any DPs out of Taco for a while. He they, hasn't jumped. He's he's either sitting on it or well he's not being aggressive with it uh, either. So like Laura admittedly oh has, like, caught Ryan, with the overhead. Ryan hasn't jumped in on him this whole time yet. Now that's the V skill, right? That yes, long that overhead. Yes, that weak that flip kick. Yeah, it's our V skill. I, 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 I wanted not, the elbow. I wanted the elbow so bad right there. Just like, I did, Get out of the sky! I did not read up on what Laura's new V skills or uh, V triggers going to be. Oh, I have no idea. Oh, can't that could be big damage. Can't throw that sweep out there, oh. sir. Oh, got around the other side. Oh no! With oh, the command grab. So close to stun. What do you think, Jad? Uh, stun meter or no stun meter? Oh no! Would stun. you rather know or not? What you mean, seeing it? Yeah. Oh, uh, I've always loved to see it. No guessing at all. Plus, it's easier on spectating. Like, you know when somebody's about to get stunned. That's true. I was saying, oh, you should have ran into command grab. Had the right idea, just did it a little too slow. Get off of me. Now, here's something I didn't realize until very recently that they did away with in this one. Um, in Street Fighter IV, uh, they had the mechanic of uh, letting you know what the window was for your next hit by flashing the life bar. Yep. Uh, and that is completely absent from five. That is correct. That was one of the things I was surprised they took out. Yeah. However, it may not have been off use, but it did seem like it was useful. However, in um, Arcade Edition in training mode, you will be able to see if you are plus or minus on all of your attacks because your characters will be color coded. That's very nice. I'm glad they did that. So if you hit someone, and if you're <laughs> if you're plus on block, you'll be blue. But if you're minus on block, you'll be red. Heaven forbid they just write this shit down like another Realm Studio game. 
Well, that required them releasing a complete game to begin with, so. <laughs> Yeah, props to, props to NetherRealm. Injustice 2 may not get as much fanfare, but it, it was a whole game when it came out, and it keeps getting better. Yeah. Nice. Oh. Getting the Laura Blender. Oh, yeah. <laughs> She's already got the ice. That was bad. <laughs> <laughs> Lightning! <laughs> see, there, see oh. that, that right there. That's what I wanted to see him do earlier. Yep. Like, just get in there, and it's like, I'm just going to grab you. All right. Taco sitting on V-Trigger. He's got to use it. Now he's oh! sitting on the ground because he got command grabbed. Very nice stuff out of both competitors. The Ryan Vile coming out on top to continue his uh, parade through losers. Yay. All right. So are we going to now see the other winner's quarterfinal match, XDSC Hitman versus War Machine? Possibly. Yes, we are. Indeed. Awesome. Our recent transfer from the Cleveland area. Combat Rays. Fighting our uh, good old friend, Zach War Machine. Stop! You're up. It is. All right. Just to make sure. Yep. So I hit it once last time, and it just didn't. It's, <laughs> it's a, what it said, what do you want? It sounds like the... Sounds like the opening of that subway rant of Aaron from Game Drums. Hey, what do you want? Uh, sweet onion chicken teriyaki, foot long on flatbread. What was that? <laughs> Did you say flatbread? Uh, yes. <laughs> hey, can I get Swiss cheese? What kind? Oh, fucking. <laughs> get mad. Like, the, the kind I just said? <laughs> You want it toasted? Of course, of course, toasted. You can get the flat. How do you get the flatbread and not toasted? It's it's starchy, squishy bread. It's designed to be toasted. <laughs> you remember that show Reboot? Fuck yeah, I love Reboot. So do you remember the chef that was always in the back of Dot's Diner? Oh yeah. What? What? <laughs> Doesn't matter what was going on. It could be life or death situation with Megabyte come out. What? In interesting <laughs> trivia. That man inspired the career of Little John. I doubt that. <laughs> but you can't disprove it. I, you can't prove it. <laughs> I think it works. Goes more in my favor. Hey, hey, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna adopt the the vaccines cause autism. Uh, uh, they turn and turn it around like, yeah, there's no evidence that they don't. But guess what? There's no yeah, there's a, that they that they cause it. But guess what? Turn that around. There's no evidence that they don't. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Yo, the moment I heard some dude say that shit, I was, I was about to jump through the television and punch that man like three weeks in the past. Yeah, I bet, because like, it's dumb as hell. It's the dumbest fucking thing. Like, you can't confirm a negative, you dumb shit. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Bison, anyway, this is happening. Bison versus Balrog. I'm sorry. Dictator versus Boxer. <laughs> Since we have the actual bar on, it's kind of true. The two that are fucked up are right here. Well, two of the three that two are fucked up. Two of the three up. that are fucked up. But yeah, welcome, uh, drum major at uh, XDSC Hitman today. Wow, nice counter hit. Yeah, he just. I'm a purple jab you. Yep. What I'm are you gonna a, do? You gonna a, hold this? Yep. You gonna hold this flaming medium punch? Did you call it a media punch? Medium. Oh, I thought you said media. <laughs> no, man, I mean, you're gonna hold this Me media, media punch. I'm media like, punch would be a great move, though. I think. That's why I was like, looking at you like, what did you just say? <laughs> I, I need like a like a social media like like obsessed uh, uh, character to, to come out in season four. Facebook kick. <laughs> yeah, Facebook media kick. punch. Twitter headbutt. And for the super, we've got snap jacket extravaganza. Yep. Be the Snapchat Azuna. Nah. Takes a selfie like halfway through the maneuver. No, see, in order for something to be an Azuna, 
Ah, ooh, missed that tap. Oh, but yeah. in order for something to be an Azuna, it has to be something that starts off high and gets down low. So it would be my space Azuna. <laughs> no, it, it'd be that fat girl angle then. <laughs> the fat girl angle Azuna. So we gotta bring, is we gotta bring a, uh, what was it, awareness to long dead meat stuff. Yeah, the, the Comey 2012 half Nelson. I could get behind that. <laughs> Yo, there should be a Tumblr command grab. <laughs> It poisons you afterwards because Tumblr yep. is just the worst. It's true. <laughs> oh, X oh, Hitman won the first round. It's true, he did. <laughs> it's not paying attention at Meanwhile, all. Meanwhile, we're over here talking about like SJW sweeps and shit. <laughs> Yo, that should be a move. <laughs> that should be a command normal. SJW oh, sweep. SJW sweep. <laughs> and then one of the, you know how like each one's grab, everybody's forward and back grab has a, a name. Yep. The forward one would be like safe space. And then the back one is, I can't even. <laughs> one, one, yo, yo, I already know the, I already know the, the name for the critical art for this character. Systemic oppression. I can see that. <laughs> so, okay, so systemic oppression is the super. Is the, the, super. V, the V trigger is, uh, what the was V trigger it? is called V triggered. Yeah, V triggered. <laughs> it, it exactly. <laughs> <laughs> and they have to say it like trigger. Exactly. <laughs> oh god, this is awful. <laughs> we're, we're going to hell. <laughs> I can see the wind quote being too. Are you assuming my gender? Yeah. <laughs> She'd just be a gray blob with, a, with an androgynous hairstyle. I figured if anything, it'd be like they model it after Tilda Swinton. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Damn it, I need to go home and like draw this yep. up now. Send it into Capcom, they'll make anything. Uh, actually, no, they won't make anything. That's kind of the problem. <laughs> oh, send it to Arika then. They'll make anything. Yes. Uh, what, what's going on? Hey, Diablo Bison's joining us. Oh, they're, 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 still, they're still playing. Ooh, Arian. He looks like Bison. No, he's, devil. The, he's the devil. Oh, Diablo. I may be the devil, but your grandpa is literally the devil. Yeah. <laughs> Rick and Morty. Hey, man, I appreciate the fact that he was voiced by by Doc Ock himself, Alfred Molina. Oh, did, well, okay, cool. We're talking Spider-Man 2 Doc Ock? Yes. Oh, that was like the best Spider-Man movie. I'm trying to find something to say about this match, but they're not... They've done lot. this a million times. Like, a lot of nothing is going on. Like, Hitman will hit him once, and that's kind of it. Yeah. I mean, oh. these these guys know this matchup against each other like really, really well. It just comes down to whether they've stayed on top of their game in the downtime that we haven't, you know, or been here them, for. Or if one of them is drunk. There is that too. Oh Ooh, nice my switch. goodness! Urian, please. Oh, Urian, please. We're out of hits to give you, Urian. We we have to ration these. The war is on. Psycho. Oh, oh no! That's just threw from the grab attempt. Oh. He said, I got damage too in combos that just don't stop. I learned Get this, off of me. I learned this move from Liu Kang. He, he got it, has to kick rapidly. Yeah. <laughs> no, <but. laughs> All right. So, Hitman definitely has the life advantage. Oh, well. Had. Had. Well, still. Well, he still does. Yeah, he just won. It doesn't matter anymore. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's just dead at this point. He was dead at the time. Still, Ooh. what an amazing play out of War Machine. I mean, like... He just, knows the Urian combos. It's true. That was supposed to be a Cherry Attack, I feel. Because he just straight up just said, duck, jump a knee. I'm like, uh, that didn't do anything. Yeah, seems like a lot of War Machine's attacks are coming up just a tiny bit short. Oh, very nice. Oh, oh he tried to he tried to give him the Capcom. It's like, there it is. Like, yep. Thanks, Capcom. Every time. He does it. Oh. Alex does it. Oh. <laughs> That Akuma does it. Because that, that elbow really should have nailed Bison there. If it came out, if it was, if he started it a couple frames sooner, it would have. Yeah. Oh. Get down. Nice tackle Thanks, from War Capcom. Machine. Yep. I like that little pause. He, he did stop to fire that, to, to charge up that fireball. It was like, it was like this is going to happen. And he's like, so it would seem. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Ooh. That was machines. nice. Knocked him out of the EX, oh the EX shoulder goodness. tackle. Oh, well, straight through 2-0 victory for Hitman. Wow, that was fast. Yeah. 
But hey, that's uh, that is War Machine's first loss of the night. Uh, he's uh, very well placed in losers for a, a minimal resurgence. And who knows, we might see him again in, uh, in the Grand Finals. I'd be kind of surprised if we didn't. So, of course, we still have Rob TV lurking out there. 